guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Sarah and I hope you choose to stay a while so with everything going on in the world it's been a little bit crazy and we'll just see how things go depending on what happens with closures and stuff the Friday videos for the fashion may have to come to a halt for a little while just if I'm not able to get out of the house to do the filming um, and it would take a while if I wanted to order stuff to try on for you guys for it to get here anyways. So we're just going to have to play it by ear and see what happens next. Uh, today I did want to do a quick review of these facial wipes that I bought at Winners a couple of weeks ago. So these are the Charcoal and Rose Facial Towelettes. <clears throat> They're supposed to detoxify and hydrate. There was 60 in here for $6.99. So a really good deal. It does claim that they will, let's see, where is it? It will leave my skin feeling brighter, youthful complexion, uh, and remove all um, traces of makeup. Well, that was untrue. They did not do that. I was finding that I was using like five just to get my foundation off and my eye makeup and then at some points I was still had eyeliner and mascara on my face so I ended up buying another pack of the makeup wipes that I know I like so I will use these but they are not they do not do what they claim they're gonna do so definitely just no don't bother guys if you're looking for something that actually takes off your makeup if you're just looking for a wipe to refresh your face at the end of the day if you have a day where you're not wearing makeup that's what I've been using these for now and they are nice that way but not for a makeup day so no um, I am going to have a video uh, coming up on Wednesday that is going to be our St. Patty's Day. Yes, I know St. Patty's Day is tomorrow, but yeah, I'm not, I'm just, I'll do my makeup look, I'll film it, and then I will post it Wednesday so you guys can see what I did do. Um, with everything going on, obviously I'm not going to be going to a St. Patty's Day party at a bar or anything, so really I'm just doing the makeup look for you guys. Uh, with everything going on, I just want everyone to stay safe. If your schools are closed like they are here, keep your kids inside or go to a park or something. Please don't go out to play palaces or what have you. It's not going to help and it's going to make these measures last longer. We need to get ahead of it and stop it from continuing to spread at the rate it has been. Uh, I'm in Ontario, Canada. Really, we haven't had that many cases. I know it's like 142 as I'm filming this, but when you consider the population of Ontario, that's really not that high. Not really. It's less than half a percentage or even a quarter of a percentage of the people have gotten sick. And of all the people who have gotten sick, everybody is recovering. Here in Canada, we have had one death. Yes, one death is one too many, but I don't think we need to panic. Please, if you don't need to be buying a bazillion liters of milk, don't. As of right now, I don't know if I'm gonna have milk to feed my baby in a, couple, in a day because my local Walmart was sold out from people just buying it up. Toilet paper, fine. You know what? I have other ways that I can manage. We can use soap and water and whatever. We don't need. It's nice, but it's not a need. But people do need food. We do need milk. We need these products. Stop buying baby wipes if you don't have a baby. These things are needed for these little kids. Please let the moms and the parents buy them. I should not, we shouldn't be reading stories about people who can't find formula and have to scrounge to make it themselves at home because somebody's decided to go up and buy 
every last can of formula in the store. If you don't need it, don't buy it. One can will last you a decent amount of time. If you feel you need to buy up stuff, buy for 14 days. Buy for that two week period that if you are needing to self isolate that you can. But you do not need 20 bottles of shampoo, 20 bottles of conditioner. There's no, I just, I don't understand. All right guys, I know this is a super, sh super short video, but that's what I've got for you today. Life is a little bit stressful right now. So, you know, we're just, everybody's going day by day. The Friday videos are going to be a little bit shorter. I was able to get out this weekend to get some filming done, but they're not going to be the level that I'm used to providing to you guys. Okay. Hope you have a wonderful day. Please stay safe. Please stay healthy. And I'll see you soon.